I organized the, the lecture series uh, five years ago. And uh, it has really taken off. It's been doing very well. I was working at that time as a park guide for First Linus Pueblo Missions National Monument. And I am a writer and an author myself. And I just wanted to line up some where people could come and, and uh, talk about their books and give a good lecture and, and have fun. And that's what we've done. I'm going to be involved in it and in that we organized it. I will Donna Diner and I, you'll talk to her in a minute, she and I will introduce the speakers and, and have the Mac Center set up. And we'll, we're also going to do one lecture here at the Schaefer Hotel and we'll have a dinner theater with that. And if you haven't gotten your reservations, you probably need to do that. Um, you can call at the Schaefer Hotel and the number is 847-2888. Pop Schaefer came here from, from Indiana and he built this in uh, 1923 is when he opened up the Schaefer. He had a blacksmith shop here first that burned to the ground and he decided to put the Schaefer on, on the site. Um, when it was first built, uh, as you said, Main Street's just down the road here, the depot's here. So it was a really bustling place at that point. And uh, Pop Schaefer and his wife, Lena, ran it the most throughout the years, from the 20s until the 1970s. Jim Sloan is uh, the historian at the Harvey House Museum, and he has collected old photographs ever since he was young, and he has a wonderful collection of them. And he will be doing a presentation on Berlin and photos. And then David Polikansky, who is also a member who lives out at Deer Canyon, he has an obsession with taking pictures of old Catholic churches, and he's gone all over the state, and he will do a presentation on that. And then on the 29th, Donna Diner and I will do our presentation here at the Schaefer, starting at 1 o'clock, and they will have a lunch special starting at 11.30 before the lecture. I just wrote a new book. Uh, it's called A History of the Schaefer Hotel. And in this book, uh, we'll be presenting a lot of the information in it. We will talk about the history of the Schaefer Hotel, the different managers, and then Donna Diner will tell about the paranormal activity that has occurred here. Dixie and I are going to be talking about the Schaefer and paranormal activity that has happened here at the Schaefer. Um, and that's been said by many people over a long period of time. I'm not going to give away any, any secrets today. You'll have to come and see the show. Paranormal, what does that really mean? Um, something outside of your normal experience, something that uh, UFOs, um, ghost stories, particularly things that have happened at this hotel will either guide you to remembering your own experiences or it'll be a new experience for you. Two thousand nine was our centennial, and we came up with a whole lot of special events for that special year. And the lecture series was one of the things that we came up with. Um, our original um, lecture series was here in the Schaefer. It was an evening lecture series, and uh, we've had some rendition of a lecture series pretty much since then. But about five years ago, Dixie and Donna took that ball and ran with it, and they're doing an excellent job. Jim Sloan will be uh, having a, a slideshow and talking about the history of the uh, Boleyn Harvey House on, uh, on February the 15th. Um, David Polakansky, a friend of mine, will be uh, having a slideshow on Catholic mission churches in New Mexico and his extensive work in photographing those. And then uh, Dixie and Donna here on, at the Schaefer on February the 29th will uh, be doing a history of the Schaefer Hotel.
when you have a passion for something, it's more Eat it. And I, you know, you just don't say, yeah, hi. Hello, introduce yourself. Tell me. Quit it. I don't know yet, but we'll let you know. Okay, the next time I'm up here, I'll get a shot of it. Okay. Because I see the one at the Schaefer. <laughs>